Guys, before we jump into today's video, I'm gonna talk about today's sponsor, Manscaped. They are the best global brand for men's hygiene and grooming products. And they sent me their performance package 4.0, so let's check it out. We've got their Lawnmower 4.0 Body Trimmer. This is their fourth generation electric waterproof trimmer with advanced skin safe technology, which is important because it, you know, reduces nicks and cuts in all your most sensitive parts of the body. It has a cordless charging system and little LED lights on the front so you can see how much battery you have left. And it looks like we've also got a crop preserver deodorant and a crop receiver toner in here. They also sent me their Weed Wax nose and ear hair trimmer, which I need. My nose hairs love getting just a little too long, so this is perfect. And it also uses the same skin safe technology. For a limited time, you can get all of this plus two free gifts, the Shed Travel Bag and their anti-chafing boxers. I am gonna love using all this because as you guys know, and always point out in my comments, uh, I am a hairy boy. <laughs> so go to manscapes.com today and get 20% off and free international shipping, plus two free gifts when you use promo code CULTURE20 at checkout. Thank you to Manscaped for sponsoring today's video. Now onto the skin. I just had the best Boy Scout camping trip in the woods ever. I said, I just had the best. Uh, yeah, 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 we heard you. This is the problem with today's society. Kids are always on their phones. I don't even think they've ever seen a tree before. And what's your point? I bet you guys couldn't even last 24 hours outside. That's stupid. Why would we do that? What if a tornado came by right now and wiped out all our technology? Then what would you do? Oh my God, what if that happens? That's not gonna happen. Are you guys gonna take my bet or what? Fine, you know what? We'll take the bet. But if we win, you have to rob a bank. <laughs> Easy. Been there, done that. Not, but, but. We're not finished. You gotta rob the bank covered in mustard. Mustard? Oh, God. But if I win... <gasps> you don't mean... Oh, yeah. <laughs> Ryan, please tell me you at least set up the tent! Uh, sorta. There was an attempt. We gotta get out of here! <laughs> Being outside... Sucks. Look, we can't do this, so let's just stay here in the shed and Larry will never know. <sighs> no, it's not really fair. We can't just give up. You know why? Why? <sighs> Come on, you know why. No, I don't. Because I've got a map. A map to what? We're in your backyard. Ryan, everybody knows that all you need to survive the wilderness is a map. If we just follow it, we'll be fine. I don't think that makes any sense. So we're gonna need to take a left. <sighs> See ya. Yes, yeah, so we're lost. How are we lost? I don't know, maybe I have the map upside down. I don't know. Wait a second. This is a kid's menu from Ooey Gooey Pizza. Yeah, and their pizza's the best. <gasps> Do you hear that? I think it might be a bear. Run! <gasps> we gotta get out of here. Yeah, let me just check the map. Can I see that for a second? This is the reason we got lost in the first place! Ooh, hi. <gasps> what are you doing here? I'm homeless. What are you doing here? Well, somebody got us lost. Uh, that somebody is not me. I don't want to hear it. You guys have a map? Uh... Well, we had one. Well, if you still had it, if you had literally any map, you would just use it to get out of here. It's not that hard. But now, you guys are probably gonna die, and you're never gonna see your family again. Told you! 100% you're gonna die, actually. I just saw a wild coyote. Okay, well, there has to be something that we can do. Uh, I suppose I could help you guys survive out here in the wilderness, but it's not free, and you're gonna have to do literally everything I ask of you to. <laughs> All right, well, I guess we have no other choice. What's first? First things first, you gotta realize when you're out here, you gotta eat anything you can get your hands on. It is not easy finding food. You are not gonna find a pizza from Uigu Pizza sitting on the floor somewhere. So Anthony, you are gonna have to eat this adorable looking frog named Jeffrey. Now, I don't know if she and everything because he's waving at you right now, but you're gonna have to just close your eyes and burn his head off. No, I'm not eating this. But he won't look cute without a head. That's not the problem. I don't want to eat a frog. Please, please don't eat me, Anthony, please don't. Yeah, I don't want to, that's okay. what I'm saying. You know what? No frog for you. If you want the frog later, maybe you can have it. Wait, wait, wait. What about me? Do I not get food because of Anthony's issues? Oh, no, don't even worry about it, Ryan, because I have this pizza from Ooey Gooey Pizza. It is your order specifically with the pepperonis. I know you love the pepperonis. Um, I found it over there by the tree. No, I, I, bu I bought it. It doesn't matter where I found it. Just here. <laughs> Nice! Wait, hold on, that's not fair! How come he gets a whole pizza and I get a frog? Anthony, calm yourself. Oh my god. You have to learn. Not everyone's gonna get the same thing out here. It's not fair. Life is not fair. Some people find frog. Some people find 
Who we go with pizza? I don't make rules. You know, I could really go for some water to wash down this pizza. Ryan, that is a perfect transition into the next scene. All right, let's go. All right, boys, next up, finding water in the wilderness. It is not an easy thing to do, and you're gonna have to drink the rain. Why is he yelling? And why is he just standing there with a cup? Uh, yeah, homeless man, that's not doing anything. Don't interfere. Uh, homeless man, I'm not sure if you're aware of this, but it's not raining. Ryan, I'm so glad you asked, and I'm so glad that you were actively learning with us today. I would be happy to explain it to you. Basically, you have to do this crazy dance, and then the rain comes out of nowhere, because it likes your dance, and then you drink the rain. So, like a rain dance? Was I talking to you? So, like a rain dance? Yes, Ryan! Oh my god, you're so smart! Okay, let me try what it's done. watch ah! and as you can see the water went perfectly into into, into the cup oh my god that is delicious Ryan you gotta try some huh this is really good wait can I have a sip uh actually Ryan can, can I see that for a second No. <gasps> Fine, I'll just do the rain dance myself. I don't I don't think it'll work on people like you. What do you mean people like me? You know, like Stupid people. Then what am I supposed to do now? You could you could drink your own pee. You could pee right into this cup and drink it. Ew, no, I'm not doing that. Well, you could drink my pee. It's very clear because I'm very healthy. I'm not gonna drink anyone's pee! Fine. Next lesson, lesson number three. Kill or be killed. This is survival to finish out here, Ryan. It is no joke. Anthony, you're gonna be playing the role of an animal and I'm gonna teach Ryan how to hunt the, the animal. Uh, why do I have to be the animal? Because I, w I would never want to put Ryan in, in harm's way. I would never put him in danger, but you, you're, you're a whole different story. I literally don't care what happens to you. Wait, so I'm in danger? Is that a real knife? No, no. Ryan, this doesn't look like a real knife to you. Uh, yeah, it kind of does. Yeah, it's real. What? So now this is the part where you're going to run away, and I will inevitably catch you, and then kill you, and then eat you, and then serve you at my barbecue tonight. Ryan, are you doing anything tonight? Are you free? Um, Ryan, watch this. <laughs> I knew you couldn't survive outside for 24 hours. I can smell him. He's close. Well, yeah, this is his house. Ryan, let me do the sniffing, please. Well, I don't think this bed was fair considering my circumstances. Blah, 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 blah. Always complaining. Do you think this is some sort of joke? I was being chased around by a maniac with a knife. This is why you need to learn to be outside. Nothing bad is ever gonna happen to you inside. Found you. What did you do? Oops, I missed. Larry! Well, Larry does have more meat on him anyway, and and you don't always kill the right person when you're out in the wilderness. You know, things happen, and you can't just let the food go to waste, so eat up. Homeless man, you've taken this too far. Uh, well, Ryan, if you're not with me, then that must mean you're against me, huh? Uh, where did you get the second knife? Fourth lesson of the wilderness. Always have a second knife on you. Run, run! <laughs> Where did they go? He'll never find us in the shed. Oh? plan luring him into the shed to get attacked by the gorilla. How did you make your voice come from inside the shed? No, I... I didn't. 
Uh, that wasn't me. I don't know who that was. I didn't even know the gorilla was in there. I was just hiding. You know what? I'm just going to take this as a win and not question it. He'll never find us in the shed. Okay, I think we can agree that we are never going outside ever again. <sighs> you guys lost the bet. You're alive? Of course I'm still alive. Now you guys gotta hold up your end of the bargain. <sighs> Larry, do we actually have to do this? Yeah, you lost the bet. Okay, why is it that every time we make a bet with you, you want us to dance for you? Would you please just do it? <sighs> okay. You want us to dance? We'll dance. One, two, three. <sighs> What kind of a dance is that? A rain dance. Do you honestly think that that stupid dance is gonna make it rain? <sighs> if you wanna watch us play Rainbow Friends, then you can click the top box on screen or the link in the description down below. And don't forget to subscribe to our second channel while you're over there. Thank you for watching. Give this video a like, leave us a comment letting us know what you thought, and subscribe for more. We'll see you guys again next week. Bye guys.